Hi, I'm Rabbi Paul Arberman from Temple Beth David in Palm Beach Gardens. It seems that every week new information about COVID-19 comes out. For a little while, we were told that masks were not that effective. Now we are told that they are critical to limiting the spread of the virus. This week, they tell us that six feet of distance can help protect us, but next week they may tell us that 10 feet is necessary since droplets of moisture containing um, the virus remain floating in the air longer than we thought. Are we supposed to accept new recommendations all the time, even ones that may conflict with what we were specifically told to do just a few days ago? The story is told in the Talmud that alongside a river, a cedar tree and a patch of reeds grew side by side. The cedar tree was strong and proud. Its enormous trunk and branches were tall and splendid, reaching far above the tops of the splendor of the slender reeds below. Its majestic height and powerful appearance made the flimsy reeds nearby appear completely inferior. One day a great storm came across the river and the strong winds blew with all their might. The cedar tree, as strong as it was, was toppled over by the winds, yet the reeds were still standing after the storm. How did you manage to survive the storm? The cedar tree wondered. The reeds replied calmly, we were not blown over because we were flexible and moved with the wind. Although you are strong, you fought against the wind and lost. We, the soft little reeds, allowed ourselves to sway with the wind. When the wind finished venting its rage, we remained standing. This is the meaning of the Talmudic injunction, be a reed, not a cedar. That is to say, allow yourself to be flexible like the reed. It's true in marriage, it's true in business, and I would add, it's true when hearing new recommendations about COVID-19. Health experts are learning as they go and doing the best that they can to get us up-to-date information. If we, were rem if we remain rigid, we'll miss out on the best way to stay healthy. Be flexible like the reed, flexible enough to accept new research. The goal remains the same, staying healthy. Stay healthy, stay Jewish. See you next time.